Our summer message series is Authentic Faith. For the next seven weeks, we're in the book of James. James, the brother of Jesus, gives us wisdom and guidance for living out our faith in a genuine and very impactful way. Again, our goal as Christ followers is an authentic faith that not only believes, but also acts, that not only hears, but also does, that not only speaks, but also loves. Authentic faith makes a real difference in our lives and the lives of those around us as well. So hang on. All right, James starts off with a very counterintuitive call to consider it pure joy when facing trials. Now, I don't know about you, but my natural inclination is to avoid trials, avoid hardship, to seek comfort, to enjoy the easy life. And yet James challenges you and me to see trials through a different lens, a lens of faith and growth. He says it's really the testing of our faith, and that's training us to grow in our faith. And one of the key results in these times of trial is perseverance. So just as training in the gym helps us get physically fit, trials, James says, helps us to get spiritually fit. Now, this perseverance is not just about enduring hardship, but allowing it to do its work in us, making you and me mature and complete, not lacking anything. So in other words, healthy, fit. James helps us to see the process of spiritual growth and refinement requires patience and to trust in God's plan. Now, the other key to this training is when we lack wisdom, especially in the middle of trials, James says, ask God, ask our coach, if you will. He's gonna give us generously to all without finding fault. What a great promise. We don't have to navigate life's challenges on our own. We can turn to God, confident that he's gonna provide the wisdom that we need. Now there's a caveat. James says, make sure you ask in faith without doubting, because doubt makes us unstable, like the wave of the sea blown and tossed by the wind. So anchor your faith in God's faithfulness. So this week, would you choose to face your trials with joy Seek God's wisdom and trust His perfect plan. Be grateful for the promise of the crown of life and the assurance that God is with you and He's with me and He's guiding us through every challenge that comes our way. Have a great day.